Philip Dowden with the Lone Star Conference as Wildcat Week continues. We're joined with head ACU track and field coach Roosevelt Lofton. Coach Lofton, a couple weeks ago, um, maybe one of the craziest uh, national championships in uh, ACU history. Talk a little bit about um, the events that led up to finding out about uh, the victory for the boys. Uh, well, you know, when we when we started out, you know, we knew we could only accumulate 60 points if that was, you know, any indication. And we didn't know where that would get us. Um, we felt that it would probably get us somewhere on the podium, which is what I want, and that top four get on the podium. So that was where we were looking at. Um, it wasn't really until almost the last event when my assistant coaches came up to me and said, hey, coach, you know, um, if Amos wins the five, uh, we've won the national championship. And I'm sitting there going like, nah, nah. And then I started just sitting down saying, wait a minute, you know, and I started – calculating and we actually were ahead by half a point and Amos went out and won the five all I kept saying while he was running the five is please don't trip please don't fall <laughs> so that's kind of what led up to it um, take us through kind of after you you guys found out and realized that you are national champs again uh, talk about your emotions and and uh, the events that everybody was going through after that well, I mean, I didn't. I guess my guys would tell you that I didn't show any emotion, because um, I didn't show any emotion. Like I wasn't turning flips, but inside, my heart was like swelling all over my chest. Um, I guess when we found out about it was after, really after Amos won the five when they were getting ready to run the four by four. Um, I guess it was probably after the right after the four by four. It they showed it up on the screen, you know, and they said ACU men, you know, national champions. And that was when I was like, whoa. Coach, kind of improbable to only have four guys, um, Amos Sang, uh, Desmond Jackson, uh, Nick Jones, and uh, Ramon, Sparks. Ramon Sparks. Thank you. Uh, talk a little bit about just kind of those four guys, what they mean to you, the team, and just kind of the improbability of the, those four guys winning it by themselves. I mean, I don't – they didn't they didn't say anything to me of what their attitudes were i mean i i know from last year um three of those guys went to nationals with us last year outdoor and their attitude is you know they they come to national championship and they put it all on the line i mean um you know when you go in there and you get you know ramon who's who's now this is his third time winning the triple jump you know that that's that's big you know um nick this is the first time that i've actually been a part of a staff with Nick on it and you know Nick kind of started it off you know he 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 wound up getting fourth in the, in the shot uh, but he threw some very big throws which is gonna help him a lot outdoor and that that came our first 15 points between Ramon and Nick and and then um you know Desmond you know with his his um eight points that he got in the 60 and then another eight that he got in the 200 and, you know I gave us another 16 and you know, and then you, you add Amos in there in the mile. You know, he he got big points in the mile and then come back and win the 5,000, you know, so that so that's big. And, you know, he, he also, you know, we call him Mr. Clutch because, you know, Amos, because last year um, at conference he did the same thing. You know, he scored 40 points by himself last year at conference, which was huge, you know, and put us over the top. So, you know, those four guys are special. I mean, when you got four seniors like that, they're, they're, they're special. They're, they're an awesome group. Talk a little bit about um, just the competition that's in the Lone Star Conference and kind of where this uh, sets you for the outdoors, the upcoming outdoor season. Well, um, the the Lone Star Conference is, is kind of funny. Um, it depends on the year, as far as what each team has. I mean, you know, if if you know this year, you know, as usual, on the men's side, competition will be big between us, Angelo State, Tarleton, um, Kingsville and maybe one of one or two other teams. Um, we have a strong team. Um, I think Angelo State has a strong team. So it, it, we always go in there believing that it's anybody's race. So, you know, we go in there, you know, focused and understanding that, hey, on this given day, you know, anybody can be beat. So we go in there with a positive attitude and, you know, and hopefully that will help us be the victors at the end. But Well, good luck. Hopefully we can bring home another national championship in the outdoor season. This was Philip Dowden with the Lone Star Conference talking with head coach Roosevelt Lofton.